for the state fair finally in town coming up next week, but mm -hmm. there's some rain in the forecast. Yeah, so things are changing up for us just in time. Mother Nature has terrible timing sometimes, <laughs> but I'll take the rain however we can get it because, you know, this time of the year when we do get the storms, uh, typically they don't last for too long and they don't uh, mess anything up for too long. So if you just keep the rain gear close by, you should still be able to have a good time. And, of course, we'll be able to have a better idea as we get closer to next week. But let's talk about the state fair and kind of climatology with it as far as the rain goes. And this time of the year, we do start to see a little bit of a slowdown as far as the monsoon season tapering off. And uh, typically for September, we average about an inch of rain. So not as much as what we get in July and August, but that averages out to about a quarter of an inch per week. And this is a look at uh, past September's and uh, state fair times. And uh, you can see 2012, a uh, quarter of an inch around state fair week. And then uh, back in 2010, we had nearly two inches over an inch back in 2009. And over in 2008, of course, a little bit uh, more shy of the rain. We didn't see too much in that week of the state fair. This week, we are going to be looking at better rain chances after a really dry week uh, this week. So next week, we're going to be looking at that rainier weather pattern moving in. And so uh, we may have to dodge a little bit of the rain moving in on Wednesday. But once again, uh, this time of the year, usually those storms are, are very spread out and they do move on quickly. 67 degrees, winds are on the northeast at 8, the relative humidity at 33%. So a very nice start. We're not going to have to worry about any rain today or this weekend in Albuquerque, that's for sure. So great weekend to head up to the mountains, get outside, do some camping, do some hiking, anything like that, because even up in the northern mountains, it's going to be a pretty quiet weekend. Uh, we may see a stray thunderstorm or two pop up in the afternoon, Saturday and Sunday, but we won't see a whole lot of activity, and most of you are going to be a okay with those outdoor plans. Uh, plenty of dry air in place across the state, and that means temperatures warm up quickly, and it also means that temperatures are above average. So as we go into next week, we're going to start to see things change up a bit. This high pressure that has been controlling our weather is going to start to slip to the east. And what that means is we're going to get more moisture moving in that's been out over Arizona, keeping the storms there and out over Colorado. Some of that's going to start pushing in. And so by Monday into Tuesday and Wednesday, uh, that moisture is slowly going to progress its way across central New Mexico. And so we're going to end up looking at more showers across our northern part of the state. Uh, central mountain chain Albuquerque will be looking at better chances for rain and also across the western high terrain. Meanwhile, in the southeast, uh, you're going to stay fairly dry even going into next week. So here's a look at your seven day forecast and how things will play out up in southern Colorado. Still going to be quite warm today, 86 the high going into the weekend, low to mid 80s by Sunday. Uh, we'll start to see a little bit better coverage of those storms, but uh, really holding off until next week. And that's when it could get a lot wetter for you and temperatures a lot cooler back to the upper 70s for highs. Northwest New Mexico topping out in the low 90s and Farmington 85 down in Grants. Sunshine today, tomorrow, Sunday, even hard pressed to get the storms going. But by Monday, Tuesday, we're talking a cool off back to the low 80s, so cooling by 10 degrees, and we're going to see a few more storms around too. Southwest New Mexico, uh, we'll see more active weather here too. Starting Sunday, that moisture will be moving in from the south, so we could see a few more storms around Sunday a little earlier for you down this way, and then continue with the unsettled weather through early next week. Southeast New Mexico, again, staying mainly dry, though we may be able to squeeze out a shower or storm Tuesday, Wednesday with a little bit more moisture around. For the northeast, sunshine and no rain to talk about today or this weekend but by midweek next week looking better and looking a little cooler too. Northern mountains, a few stray storms are possible each afternoon into the weekend. Next week we'll start to see scattered showers and storms, so a lot more active and a few more storms around. Santa Fe will even uh, get in on the action Tuesday, Wednesday with much better chances for rain and cooling off two east mountains will stay dry through the weekend. Sunday, I can't rule out a stray storm, but looking much better for you Monday, Tuesday. And for the metro, low 90s for highs with plenty of sunshine and your seven-day forecast showing uh, temperatures cool off a little bit for the weekend, but it's not going to be until next week that we really get some relief from the heat. We're back to the mid-80s for highs, and we'll start to see a few more storms around Albuquerque, and that will mean a better chance for us to pick up a little rain too, especially Tuesday and Wednesday. All right, thanks, Kristen.